A Perth woman has suffered another blow. She's no stranger to tragedy, but this morning she lost everything in a house fire. There was one small blessing. Firefighters rescued her pet cat. Firefighters worked to save a life, not a human, but a cat. Trapped in a house fire, they managed to free the feline from a bedroom. How long have you been on the oxygen floor? About, about 45 minutes. But Gingy is more than just a pet. The eight-year-old has special significance for owner Christine Mack. That cat holds sentimental value to me because I remember purchasing my cat Gingy with my sister. Um, so that's, uh, yeah. Her sister was 26-year-old Michelle Mack, a teacher who died after losing control of her car in the 2J bushfires seven years ago. That was the first thing I just you know, wanted to know as well as the cats, you know, that, that Michelle's um, ashes were still okay and thank God they are. Christine Mack was with her son CJ at swimming when the fire broke out in their Scarborough home. They returned to this, their beloved Gingy on oxygen, their home badly damaged. It's unlivable. It's, it's, it's black, war, black, everything, everything looks like it's ruined. Um, yeah, yeah, unbelievable. Firefighters say the blaze started in the laundry of the Nautilus Crescent home. Christine Mack says the inside of her home has been destroyed by smoke. Everything she owns, all of her son's belongings, and she wasn't insured. She says she was made redundant just before Christmas and isn't sure where they'll sleep tonight. The family's eldest cat, Casey, is still missing. Christine fears she didn't make it. We did hear meowing, but I've been unable to locate the second cat. The vet says Gingy is stable and will be monitored overnight. Ebony Ferranda, Nine News.